Elephant connects to so many exercises, but I really love using it to teach kneeling knee stretches off, which can be a really challenging position for so many people who, especially if they think they don't have the upper body strength to do it. So let's get into it. Coming into elephant, standing on two springs, back to the shoulder blocks. For this one, you kind of want to be back as far as you can because we are going to bring the knees down and bend the knees. All right, so we've got elephant mobilizing from the femur, woo, in the pelvis, not from the back, not from pushing around in the shoulders. We've already covered all that, right? Now, what if I focus on holding those springs closed? And as I hold those springs closed, I lift heels up, Keep those springs closed. Notice how that makes me have to pull weight over the bar. And then just bend the knees. Can you get them down with control? Notice how forward over the bar I am. I have to be, okay? And now I'm going to push down in the bar to push up into that shoulder socket. Press down through the feet and let the weight rock back through the feet. Back up into that elephant position. Maybe I take a little rep and in. Now I'm going to pull myself back forward, which would be the pull you would need for up stretch, right? And I'm going to come over, getting a good flexing, bending challenge in that first metatarsal. Ooh, for those of you who have arthritis in that first big toe or bunions, that's a killer, right? But that's what opens it up, right? So now if you're used to falling back and you're kneeling these stretches to try to lift your knees up, this is teaching you really how forward you have to come. I'm more forward than I would be because I'm for way forward of the blocks. But here I'm going to come up one more time and you see that lift or rock back through the feet. I can take one more elephant. Now here we go. What if I find that place right about here and just slide back into the blocks and I'm in my kneeling these stretches off. All right? There I am. And I've bypassed this Oh, but my upper body isn't strong enough because it was already working in the first place. And then coming down onto the knees, going all the way back to the blocks. And I could continue on with the kneeling knees stretch series round, go into the flat back, any of it, and even back up into the knees off because I've taught myself where I actually have to push up into the upper body to help me up. Kneeling these stretches off and all of the long stretch series are a challenge for your upper body to make you stronger.